So yo, what is up everyone? We are playing three champion start. We got Caitlyn, Cog, and Cho'Gath off our three champion start, and we managed to two start two of them. Um, I have Zoe, so I do kind of have um, a fortune possibility. I'm kind of thinking about just slamming Death Cap with Magic Wand here on Cog. I think I will. Uh, I would like Kabuko, Timo, Tristana. I mean, honestly, it's probably Death Cap Cog, put a tier on him, and then level for Malphite, and then try and play Fortune. Because I don't really want to go contested into this guy, it's just not ideal. Oh, he went 4 as well. Okay, maybe I wasn't contested, but... Oh, you see, like, we just try and win streak and get Fortune in next stage. I think that is the current plan. Go, oh, Cho. You got this. The one thing I hate about Cog, like, this guy's gonna stop move, like, start moving and then you just don't hit them. Uh-oh. Kate did not kill Cog more. That is a disaster. I really lose this. Like, Cog who has... Two has death cap tier. I guess he has two star. Oh, I see. I'm I'm fine with this. I'll take it. Shen. Uh, redemption. Red buff. Nashes. Oh, I see. Like, isn't it frontline now? Et Hodge. T Hodge, something like this. And then we try and like drag them away. I mean, it's an absolute disaster to be honest. Maybe some of them are winnable. I, I feel like some of these fights will be winnable. <laughs> Put the Cho away from the red buff, because he does anti heal as well. Right, it's winnable. <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. Yeah, one more show and we're chilling. I see one more show, get a Nico in next level. Maybe I can play the stage three as well and get fortune in stage four. Maybe that would be better. Or I'm just missing the Kabuko now. Just missing this one Kabuko fella. Our wills align. I see so many pairs as well. I don't even hate pre-level here. I just hate it because I want Kabuko. <laughs> it's like the only reason I don't want to do it. I see Teemo 3 could be an option too. Actually, there's a too healthy player. I've seen Fortune players sometimes cash and just play Teemo 3 for trick shot. Doesn't even look bad. Looks pretty decent, honestly. I mean, I'm kind of down to get Fortune in Stage 4. Instead. I probably want Adaptive Helm of Carousel. I feel like that's the most flexible. Like AP Mana Gen item. Like, Blue Buff users don't mind Adaptive Helm. And Shoujin users like it too. Whereas, like, if you build Shojin and you play, like, a blue buff user, like, Sindri, it doesn't feel as good. It's still okay. Say it's the most adaptive? Exactly. Exactly. Adaptable helmet. This is Shen 2, by the way. Like, are you Shen 2 or adaptive helm? I'm Shen 2. Shen 2 is Shen 2. Like, that's like the best unit in the game right now. I'd not be taking Shen 2. I mean, you can, but like, you shouldn't not be taking Shen 2. Shen 2, Cho 2. Suddenly the comp looks really good. I mean, I think I should make Econ here. So the Malphites are probably gone. Doesn't feel great, but. I mean, I need Healing Redux somehow, but it's probably Crown Guard. Probably crown guard. Yeah, let's just sit here. 
It's fine, I'll find a Kabuko eventually. I can actually get good fortune losses probably with a Shen too. I'm sure he's fine to just have in there. The Kha'Zix go easy on me, bruh. Bro, this Kha'Zix is tanked infinite. Okay, get the Kindred here. Nice. Okay, I'll be honest, Shen 2 really let the team down there. At least we made 10. And we didn't take a huge loss. Bro, this Kabuko is better spawn in, man. This guy better spawn in. Does Krogmore suck? Like, what's happening here? I feel like if I don't get fortune in, my game's doomed, so... Okay, also wants to get fortune in, though. It's okay. We'll get it in. We'll get it in. Drop, drop. Drop. And then I play Behemoth Frontline. This guy's trying to lose. Brilliant. Huge for me. I mean, my icon's not great, I'll be honest. I have a lot of upgrades. The board's a bit expensive. I probably should have just kept the Malphites, honestly. And then I still have the option of playing this reroll comp. But honestly, it's just not. We're just not playing this reroll comp ever. We're just waiting for our Kabuko guy. It's like even this, like the cog doesn't feel great. I would love a mythic unit, but alas, no. I would love five fortune, so I could heal three. The five fortune buff is crazy. Like healing three extra health per round, that's so nuts. 29. It's a disaster. Shojin? You don't love it. I'll be honest, you don't love Slam and Shojin here. Boom. Okay. Let's think about it. It's probably Mythic, and we probably do Slam Shojin. It's okay that it's not Adaptive Helm. Doesn't feel as good, but it's okay. Now we kind of want to look for Tristano or Kabuko. Then we're kind of in a better spot. How long is it? Is it just the two adjacent allies? It's not bad. Guy doesn't have it in yet either. But he does have a Teemo with some sick items. Yeah, you got me, Cog. Who are you hitting with your ults here? Okay, down for that. Now hit, hit the Teemo. Okay, down for that. Now hit the Teemo. Boom. Nice. Good job. Nice. Good win. Pretty good win. Guy was streaking. That guy? I'm level 5, bruh. Um, I feel like it's always Bulwark here. I was looking for an Econ Augment, but it's okay. Not going 6 here, is it that bad? I think it's fine. It's fine. My Shen's in a Mega Tank. No Mega Tank. Okay, my game is so doomed unless I play Fortune. Is that agreed? I think that's agreed. Like, I actually just have to play it. And then I need to get good losses as well. It's like actually rough. But then once if I do fortune cash and I hit like a Huey too, I just one shot everyone. But Doom, I mean I think the Doom is fine. I think it's fine here too. But I'm not playing Kogri roll. 
It would be really good if I was playing Cog Reroll. I'm winning at level 5. That's pretty good. Shen's a beast. Come on, Kabuko. Where are you, bro? Where are you hiding, man? Come out of your shelter. Get over here, bro. You guys playing Fortune. Like, at this stage, we're going to have to play Fortune next stage. Which is not good. <laughs> That's a disaster. I mean, it's not bad. It's just not great. Honestly, it's not great. Yeah, I'm down to play someone Giga Week, if that's possible. Like, the Fortune guy would be good. I'm really down to play the Fortune guy. It's the ghostly guy. He's playing Fortune. Okay, great. This is great. It's honestly great. I'm going to get Fortune in Stage 4. That's the plan. I just have the best tank in the game. Shen 2. This guy's a beast. Nice. That's taken three unit losses versus me. Okay, we're going to tech Fortune in and then play uh, Lost Streak until level 9. Board. I think. I, I think. I'm a bit nervous, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I would have loved an Annie off Carousel here, but it is also what it is. I would love Rod here, but it is not great for me. Crit, armor crit, sounds okay. Armor crit sounds fine. Three games before you shunt him, now you expect to come out, he's probably crying under a tree. That's alright, he's here. I found him. Um, honestly, yeah, like, I just leave this in for now. I'll go 7 and play at 7. I'll play... Yeah, like I probably just don't even play it yet. That's the thing. What if I get Ghostly like, Arcanist Warden in? I'll, I'll play it starting stage 4. I feel like that's just the better idea. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna lose this anyway. It'll go easy on me, Kha'Zix, okay? You actually want to jump to Kabuko. Nice, good job, bro. Oh? Haiki winnable. Oh, so close, man. I'll take a two unit loss here. I don't even have fortune in yet. That was a great effort, bro. Great effort, Kogmore. You tried your best. Okay, so we go seven, we put fortune in, and we start cashing. And then eventually our board looks like... Uh, one, Rakan. Azir. I think it's Annie, Zeraka, Diana, um, Wukong On, Wukong On. Yeah, I mean, maybe get Udir in as well then. Something like that. I think it should be fine. We'll figure the rest out. Most important thing is we just get get the fortune in next next stage. Alt or oh, NT. Oh, Cog? Kobe? Kobe. Oh. Kobe. <laughs> He's crazy. Okay, let's get the fortune in now. Alright. I need someone who can kill single target units. I mean, honestly, Cog's pretty good. But I need snipering if I'm going to play Cog, so we could just drop this. Could just drop Mythic. I don't hate it. Like, I actually don't hate it. I think it's fine.
I need a rod. That's what I need. First. Five turns. Easy. Five turns is easy for a guy like me. I mean, I probably want to get Mythic in. But how? Like, there's no way I'm playing that. I guess level 8 put Tom Kenshin, and it might do alright. I mean, in my head, this board shouldn't be winning, like my board, but it should kill units because it's got a Cogmore in it. Okay, Zoe, kill the Kaiser here, just to get an ult off. Oh, NT. Yo, Delina, nice to see you. Welcome, welcome. Five combats. We're going to cash one then. Cash one is fine. One, two, three, four, five, and then we're, then we're at neutrals. So it's a good roll. I mean, honestly, isn't it just one, two, three, four, five? This is more gold, actually. Oh no, this is more gold. Set. It's fine. Not oh, great. Not bad. Just sell him. I literally never play this guy. Forty-four. Kind of down to level for Tom. Just because I know it's so doomed if we don't level for Tom. I gotta go, but I'll leave a luck. Oh, oh, no worries. Take it easy, Delina. Level for Tom here. I would love to buy Kaiser, actually. Nash is two. It's a good slam. I mean, we want to lose this. But this guy kind of looks okay. Nice. Looks like we should use this, hopefully. But my cog's just an absolute demon. Nice, it's a great loss. It's a great loss. It's actually such a good loss. Okay, we need to go fast nine. Then we cash. Three more combats. It's just not that much though. They expect it, like if you lose five on stage four, you're taking infinite damage. Surely they need to give me like million billion HP back. Yeah, honestly, my board looks fine though. Like my board actually looks decent. I could actually sell the Teemo here. Recon. But it's like if I see Annie off carousel or off shop, then I instantly start healing three per turn. It's pretty good. It's like pretty good. This is the one guy, fated guy. Like, do I even kill one unit here? It's pretty rough. This guy's rough. Maybe I can kill the Orn. Nice, I can. Can I? But this one is not dying. Well, that's good. I got the good losses earlier. Annie here. Oh, there's an Annie, but Hui is just way better. I also need healing Redark, so I need Rod. Okay, 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 okay. Hui's just got to be better than Annie, man. It just has to be. Even though, like, Annie is literally 6 HP right now. That's how much Annie counts for. I wonder if I even win out after I cash here, because I can't really go 9. Like, do I even have enough gold to go 9? Maybe after cash I do. Feels weird not to play Alessandra here. Pretty sure I meant to play Alessandra here.
And then I may as well start stacking this. So I can insta dupe something first turn. Hey, Lissandra can farm me golden money. This has to be good. That's crazy. Already insane. That's already value. Next gives me 13. It's not bad. Is 35 a break point? 40 is a break point. 30 is okay. I mean, the problem is you kind of want 40. But like, I'll, I'll take 35. I'll take 35. Oh. Wait, I'm fast 9. I'm actually fast 9. This guy just said FFS. He's 0 gold. How much gold does everyone have? I'm, I'm rich, rich. This guy's also rich, though. And this guy's going fast 9, too. But I'm fortune cashing fast 9, so maybe we're fine. Fifty-one to level. Now it's actually realistic. <laughs> Whereas before it wasn't, but now it's actually realistic. Now it's actually realistic. When we get the Azir in, I key I really need a nanny, but like it is what it is. I'm down for list to kill this Galio. This fight would be good. Next ult, maybe. Okay, we're gonna take a fat loss here. It's part of the process, it's okay. 17, it's basically two lives. What do I even want from this? Like six gold and three components? Two, three costs? I mean, I want gold. All of them give at least like six gold. I don't want the term, I'll be honest. Cash out. Sell, sell, sell. As it in. Three components. Children. I mean, it's okay. It's not great. I, I need a Morello. I don't get a Morello, this game's probably ff ball. Zerak is good. Timo doesn't need to get duped. No Morello, but there is a red buff. Level now. Just start buying good units. I should have bought the... What's it called? Media in. I need Seraka in. Vishen. Okay, like, what am I missing? I have Lissandra in for no reason, but like. Aside from that, aside from Soraka, oh, I, I need Invoker, I need Invoker, that's what I need. Okay, one, inch, one, inch, one unit loss. Ikikon. Wow, I'm actually really surprised I lost this. It's, it's Annie over this. Any other less? Any other sky items on this guy? Uh, even Lily is fine. Okay, this is fine. On Prince item to this, Wukong can go. I mean, honestly, like, like Udia should just go full side. Way middle. Nice roll down. Hit. Two star five costs and GG, yeah. Just need to hit now. Just need to hit now. Definitely a decent roll down though. No shred yet. 
So let's try and prioritize Shred from here on out. Yeah, took the loss. We just need Annie over Lilia as well, would be great. I need more frontline than this. I feel like my frontline's just very exposed right now. One more turn and I got way too. Component Anvil is or is a full item right now. But I think it's 10 gold. I feel like hitting a 2 star 5 cost is massive here. That's massive. Annie over Lilia is massive. And now we have frontline. Feels much better. I would love some kind of healing. I could... Okay, I should actually roll here. Okay, because if I saw Hui or Rakan, then I know that I should dupe the other one. The only thing is, like, without Azia 2, Hui 2, this is like a very awkward fight. This fight here is very awkward. Like, this is probably the hardest fight for me at the moment. The current fight. Nice. That's huge. I'm gonna roll once. After we win this. To min-max. Okay. Didn't hit either. And then we would lock shop and, and swap. See which one to dupe. I mean, I'm probably stable at Azia 2 or Rakan 2. I probably need one of them. Uh, Wukong Pair is huge. Spark is great. Spark is really great. But Wukong Pair is really, really, really great. It's probably Spark, right? It's probably Spark. I like Wukong Pair is huge, but... Like, if we don't have Shred, we can't do much. I mean, I probably econ till neutrals now. Oh, we can Okay. Spark this guy. Looks okay. I can print this item. Go this side. My left side looks a bit too weak, actually, if I do this. So let's just go back to the position I was in before. But as you're now on the same side as Spark. I'm on team. You got me ever? You got me ever team? Gold. Don't let the ghosty board beat you team. Come on. You can do better than that. Good job, good job, good job. Nice, nice, nice. Knocked him out. That's huge. Okay, I mean, I will. I think I can go 10 after I stabilize on Wukong 2 or Rakan 2. Oh, this, I can't go 10. Ah, this game's over. I can't go 10. I can't go 10 this game. Oh. Oh, once. I don't know. Why did I roll? There's no way I'm selling any pair. I rolled to lock. <laughs> I mean, okay, realistically, I beat the Faded guy. Realistically, I should beat this guy. And if I don't, it's just giga rough. But realistically, I think I should beat this guy. Honestly, I'm kind of scared of the set. That's about it. Oh my gosh, it's actually going on my way. It might be fine. I have anti-heal and shred into, into Faded. That's like this. I mean, the set is legit smurfing on me. Dude, my Hui is so low elo. I mean, he tried his best. Okay, as your ult should kill Syndra here, though. Nice. Big. Big win, big win. Boom! Nice. The Elim. Let's go with top two, I think. They looked both pretty low. Except the first place guy. Oh no, we're not. We're not. We're not top two. 
Be nice. I mean, this is about as good as it gets, really. Hit the Wukong. No Azia 2 is rough. I'll be honest, no Azia 2 is a little rough. It's okay. Big win, good job, Tom. Thanks so much. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Get this one item onto Rakan. It's a lot of damage, this Rakan guy. Roll here. Wukong 2. Or Azir. Azir or Wukong! Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, we're looking for... We have we have Shred. We have Anti-Heal. Edge of Night. Wukong sounds okay. Honestly, another Spark sounds fine. Like, what if it's just Spark Udia? This guy does magic damage. Kind of down. I also could have watched the fight and then decided. I'm so down for Spark Annie here. I'm sparking you, dear. I know Annie dies too quickly to the Syndra. At least he sparks backline here. He's applying Spark on backline. That's good enough for me. Looks winnable. Looks winnable for sure. Dude, Orn is so OP. This guy's just printing items onto my team. I love that. Rakan's got an item, Wukong had an item. Everyone's got items. Nice win. This guy beat me. Please, okay, just Wukong or Azir. Just either one, either one. Yeah. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I mean, this guy looks pretty scary to me, to be honest. It does look pretty scary. I don't even know how I'm into position here. Like, Lissandra's ulting my... My Udia is pretty rough. Did he swap? If he swapped, I lose. Yeah, he did. I probably lose this, to be honest. Well, it's just Cyrelia, actually. Maybe it's fine. Uh, yeah, I think if he swapped whole board, I lose. If it's just Cyrelia, maybe I, I, I'm i okay. Boom. Go, 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 go. Nice team. I mean, I'm fortune cashed over this guy, by the way. Truly, I went out. He's going 10, though. That's a little scary. Please. Please. Please, just one. Okay, I mean, Azzy is way more important. Okay, he's 10 now. Okay, the most important thing is uh, my one doesn't get less ulted, I think. And that Rakan touches on. And that sparks are each side. Let's try this. I think this positioning looks fine. What did he add at 10? I don't know. Okay, I mean this fight looks good to me. We're gonna get an Azia too as well. Go, 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 go. Nice, that's a huge win. That's a huge win. Now we have Azia too for next fight. I need to look to deny stuff maybe. Let me, let me look at this board. Heavenly Spat? It's maybe Heavenly Spat. He wants it. Hodge also pretty good for him, honestly. But, I mean, having these spats just best for both of us. Please, a Wukong. No! It's the wrong one! It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I can sell this for 8. It's actually worth. Nice. Okay. Uh, I, I'm actually going to put this on a unit that I don't want to print all items onto. Probably you. Uh, it looks like he swapped sides here, so we're going to do the same. Okay, someone take a sword. Oh, he swapped and then swapped back. What a beast. Fair enough. It's great Azir ult right into the center board. I mean, we're Wukong 2 now. Azir 2 now. My Hui is dead, though. 
My Hui is dead though. But my, my Uti is a beast. Okay, it's great. It's a first. Huge. GG everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, remember to like, comment, subscribe. You guys are the goats if you made it this far. Thank you so much.